Here is Brandstrom wandering into the circle. Still with it. Nobody's moving. He shoots. Scores. Went off a stick in front, I believe, but Brandstrom will get his first goal. Nobody was moving out there. Brandstrom was more or less just holding on and didn't really see an option. But he ends up taking the shot and finds a hole and beats Wall and a five on three power play. The Schwab relays for Brandstrom to center. Looking for room down the wing. Gets it across the line and scores! On balance! Brandstrom avoids a check at the blue line. He's still off balance doing the old one-legged thing. Let's it rip and beats Kaskasuo for his second of the year, both of them against the Toronto Marlies. He's got this huge smile on his face, and why not? Wow. To the blue line, Brandstrom set, waits, fires, scores! Eric Brandstrom from just inside the line. This time, there were bodies out in front of Kevin Poulin. It was tipped in front of the goal. Morgan Klumchuk, I think, got a stick on it. And so Brandstrom, that little extra moment that he held on off the pass, and then when he did let it go, Diving in, Asperola, shot, tip, scores. Boy, that one was a read from a long way back. I'll tell you, some patience in the offensive zone as you hang on to the puck. And waiting is Eric Brandstrom, who does a good job of watching his partner leave his position on that left blue line. Off of Brown, back to Jordan Murray. Brandstrom waits, then shoots, blocked. He's got it back again, moving to his left. Brandstrom goes far side, scores! The screen was set. Brandstrom took an extra step to his left, and he was on the same plane as we are. Uh, entirely by the work of Eric Brandstrom. He took a shot from the point that got blocked. He recovered the rebound immediately from the far side point, skates to the near side into the circle, and then just finds a little bit of daylight to get that puck through to the net. It caught iron. Up to center over the line comes Brandstrom, breaks through, shoots right on, went to a rebound on the right side. It's right off the bat, they wanted to get some momentum going, and the center just broke it up very effectively. Now stick handling effectively through center is Brandstrom. To his left goes the play. Bolsters gets it. Goal is score. Coming through on the rebound was Jordan Swartz from the right side. And Jordan Swartz will put Belleville ahead two to nothing with the seventh of the year. Rudolph Balsers has been on the rookie scoring list and high through most of the year. Sends taken away at center. Brandstrom down into the corner and just kept off balance enough. Norris picks up the puck. He scores. Josh Norris was there when Brandstrom got taken off the disc and one times at home. Senators take a one nothing lead on Norris's 17th goal of the year, extending his point streak to seven games. And a big play by uh, Eric Brandstrom to kind of fight his way into the zone. He took a wall up into the end wall, but presence of mind to at least throw the puck toward the net. Brandstrom for Logan Brown and back to Brandstrom as they go 1-3-1. Pass across the box, scores! Beautifully set up. Morris takes it on the near half boards, touchback, Balsers to Brandstrom, to Batherson, scores! Cross for Schwartz, left off for Jordan Murray. Brandstrom sends it across, there the tip in front, they score! Now back to the line, Brandstrom, far circle. Brown back to Brandstrom, walking in, Brown shoots, scores! From the far circle as Brown holsters his stick. Fed out in front, shot, scores! Rudy Bolsters in the far circle, takes the pass across. Took a little extra second to pick a spot. Senators take a two to one lead. Rudolph Balsers gets his second point of the game and his 14th goal of the year. These things tend to even out. Better make them pay. Brandstrom, right circle, scores! Norris unloads and ties the game with his second of the game. I tell you what, this kid is something else. 
Josh Norris with a lightning quick release from the far side. Pretty well hash marks. He was pretty wide on the uh, ice near the boards. And just as you say, Jack, unleashed one. Nice face-off win by the Senators. Worked back quickly, left point to Brandstrom. Pulls it around the defender. Holds on patiently and then just puts it on a tee. Norris to the blue line. Brandstrom, Norris, one-timer, scores! Schwartz was in front of the goal and may have been able to tip that one in. And the Senators tie it up on the power play. He'll face another one of his former teams. Sends get in across the line, slapped over on the left wing side, center and scores! Abramov goes to the net. A bit off balance on the pass through and knocks it in and the Senators are on the board. Brandstrom getting the feed across and Abramov just to the near side of the net gets the one-timer away. And the left-handed shot from the right side makes no mistake. It gets blocked. Nice play by Batherson, and Murray denied. Batherson puts it in front for Norris. Shoots, he scores! Pick the far side, and Josh Norris regains the lead for the Belleville Senators with his 11th goal of the season. Brandstrom up top on the right side. Here is Brandstrom into the middle. He will leave it for Norris. He fakes the shot. Norris feeds it cross ice. Played back by Abramov. Fired. Scores! Brandstrom to a little traffic right through the slot and in. And that timeout paid off. And the Senators still on the power play and with a 2-1 lead. And not as flashy as his goal last night that, as you mentioned, uh, drew some eyes on social media, but picture perfect uh, play-wise. If Brandstrom sets up at the top of the umbrella and uh, just had a lane to shoot, he didn't even uh, clap that as hard as he possibly could. He just made sure he got good contact on the puck, kind of a half slap shot, and uh, got enough on it to get it past Primo and to give Belleville that first lead of the night. An excellent response after going down early here for the Senators. And they're still on the power play for a minute and a half.